Welcome to the Lotus Goddess Divine Love. Hi everyone, how's everyone doing today? Hope you're doing well and staying safe. Welcome back everyone. Welcome if you're new to my channel. I do Divine Mask and Divine Feminine Twin Flame Journey readings. And let's get started and just keep in mind that this is a general reading. Let's see what messages comes through. So in this reading, um, this Divine Masculine is showing that this Divine Masculine is seeing that there's no chance to pull this connection back together between him and a karmic person. It's like this is not working. Um, I don't know if we, we can continue any further. And Masculine here is showing that this is a lost cause like this is this is done there's no point in me trying to put more time and energy into something that i know it's not going to work this was a sudden realization a sudden shock i feel like for the divine masculine and it has to do with when it came to the time to actually fully invest in that connection this masculine felt felt a hesitation it shows here that at the time when he thought that he would completely commit to this person, he thought about Divine Feminine. He was comparing. He was analyzing. He was thinking. I feel like his emotions were, were back and forth, back and forth. He didn't have a very clear, clear mind where he could fully commit to this person. It's like, unconsciously he was it's like in the back of his mind he knew that he was not in the right place and when it came time to actually commit to this individual he pulled away it shows here that he withdrew he didn't expect himself to do that he this came it shows here it came to a shock for this masculine and at the same time, he, he knew that by putting so much effort into something that is not actually working, what is the point? Why am I here trying to make this work, knowing that I have feelings for Divine Feminine and knowing that this is not working out anyways? And they made, it feels like a very tough decision because I feel there's a lot of things that were involved. It has something to do with this Divine Masculine's plans. Plans, uh, dreams, something he was working on that was very, um, it, it may have involved others as well, but it shows here that he put a lot of effort into making something happen or some sort of dream to come true. And the thought of it not working out feels like a, a huge loss and making this decision made him feel like before he decided to do what he did, it's like accepting that it's done was the hardest thing for him to accept. So once he accepted that, he withdrew from this connection especially when he knew he had feelings for Divine Feminine. Showing here that the past really played a big key role in his decision. He hasn't forgotten you. He hasn't forgotten the things you said. He hasn't forgotten the dreams you shared. He, does, he doesn't... He remembers the things that he promised you that he was unable to fulfill. And the decision he made, he really thought it through. It was a very well thought out decision. And it shows here that 
He went within, intuitively, was guided, went with his feelings, his emotions, and intellect as well because he analyzed the situation where he was at and what he can have, what are the possibilities out there. This Divine Masculine, when it came to his feelings for Divine Feminine, he was very guarded. He didn't want to share even with Divine Feminine what he felt for Divine Feminine. And he didn't even accept it himself. It's like he felt the feelings, but he didn't admit that he had those feelings. He didn't admit it to himself either. But now it's showing that He's embraced the feelings that he has for Divine Feminine. There's a lot of love, a lot of passion, a lot of wanting to be with Divine Feminine, the desire to have that reunion with Divine Feminine. He wants to speak his truth. He wants to speak about how he feels for Divine Feminine. And he wants to talk about a new beginning, a new start a fresh new start, something that involves stability, that involves the future, having a beautiful life together. This masculine feels he's very lucky to disconnect from this uh, karmic situation at the right place at the right time. He feels like it, it dragged him for quite some time. This masculine, his heart is showing here, his heart was like, his emotions were tied down to a situation that he was not not supposed to be in for that amount of time. It's like he was meant to feel the emotions, to experience what he experienced, and then move forward. But the amount of time I feel that that delay, he feels that I'm lucky that it finally, I finally disconnected. I feel like now he's like, if I knew it was going to be this, um, I would feel this calm afterwards. I would have done this way sooner. It's like, what was I fearing? Why, why was I so worried about separating from this person? If I knew I would feel this way, this peace, this lightness that I feel today, how it feels like to be free again, feel like that freedom that that heavy weight has been lifted then I would have made the decision much sooner than I did but he feels that lucky I did it now rather than rather than later when it was too late he feels like he still has a chance I'm so lucky I still have a chance there's still time for divine feminine and I even if time has passed even if this masculine feels he is older. He's like, but I, I still, I'm still here. Divine Feminine is still here. And we still have this chance together. He doesn't want to take this, this opportunity for granted. This opportunity for reconnect. Showing here that when he was in this cycle with this karmic person he was really unaware of what he was in when he was in it it's like when he was in it he was blinded by what was surrounding him it wasn't until close to the the end of the connection the separation near separation time where he felt that he was stuck that there is a, there is something else out there that i need to see and it shows here that he really wanted to have a life where he can celebrate where he can get, give this offer to someone and be fully committed to someone and also feel that they are loyal that they are genuine that they want to have a happy loving life as well and Knowing what happiness really feels like, he was not aware of what happiness, what love felt like at that time. It wasn't until when he was really tired of this connection with this person that he longed for happiness, that he longed for that, that freedom, that peace, the release of that heavy load, the baggage. 
the dragging out. Some, it's like something that was long overdue. And it took time for this masculine to come into his strain to make that decision. But he made this decision because it was also divinely guided. This is divine timing here. That helped nudge this masculine to separate, to disconnect from this person, from this connection that he was in for quite some time. It shows here that there's supposed to be a brand new beginning. The old cycle closed. A new cycle begins. A new fresh cycle. Beautiful, colorful cycle. And colorful meaning sharing all the love, the emotions, the blessings that come with it. Wish fulfillments. A lot of work, time, energy will be put into this new cycle that will be worth it. It's like, it doesn't matter how tired Divine Masculine might get from the amount of work and energy that they put into whatever that they are doing, whether it be a project or something having to do with their mission work. It's like in the, in the end, at the end of the day, it's like it's, it was worth it. There's no regrets. There's nothing. It's just like I'm here to serve. It's like be, putting, putting the time and energy into service. What are they meant to do? And this mask is willing to do that in the new cycle. New cycle, having clear direction of where, where to go, what to do, providing a guidance, providing um, and having good opportunities that will lead this divine masculine into other, it feels like other avenues, other um, prospects that is going to really elevate the connection for divine masculine, divine feminine. One more thing I see here in this reading this masculine, when he comes towards the divine feminine, he will really come with truth and he will show who he is as a divine masculine, meaning that the lessons that he's learned, the skills that he's obtained, and the gifts within the masculine that can help in their mission work together. So the skills divine feminine has, the skills divine masculine has, and also there's going to be an energetic exchange that's going to help these two have more knowledge of who they are as divine counterparts in union as well. It's like enough with the old, it's time for the new. Like there's close off this cycle now. Enough is enough. This mask is like enough with the old. I'm ready for the new. This is somebody who's ready to um, get started and, and to put in the work and effort um, into this connection and into their soul mission work together. So this is the reading for today. If you like this reading, please subscribe to my channel. Leave a comment, thumbs up, and thank you all for watching. Have a great day. Bye, everyone.